Hey, what's up? Today we have the last video about Yamadichi X smartphone. If you missed, we already made unboxing, performance test and battery test. It is time to do camera test. It should be interesting test, because Yamadichi X has 48 megapixels triple camera on the back. Is it really good? Let's find out. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel Tech Brothers. Imodigi X has a triple camera on the back, 48 megapixels main sensor, Samsung GM1 with f1.79 aperture, 8 megapixels ultra wide angle camera, and 5 megapixels depth camera. The selfie camera has a 16 megapixel sensor with f2.0 aperture. The camera app of Imodigi X has following shooting modes: short video, slow motion, video, photo, 48 megapixels, portrait, and panorama. Ultra wide angle mode is available only in photo and video mode. As you understand, you cannot use 48 megapixel sensor for shooting wide angle photos. There is a special 8 megapixel sensor for wide angle shooting. Also, you can see flashlight, HDR, and AI at the top of the screen. The camera settings menu has many options, such as picture size, grid line, shutter sound, etc. In video settings menu you can choose video resolution, Full HD is maximum. Also, there is electronic image stabilization. That's very good. Now let's look at real sample photos taken on Umidigi X. I have two images in 48 megapixels mode and wide angle mode. As you can see, the photos are really good, both 48 megapixels and wide angle. To be honest, I was very skeptical about wide-angle mode, but Umidigi X does take good images, but only in daytime. If you look at night photos, the wide-angle camera is very bad. You should forget about taking wide-angle photos at night. The bokeh photos are pretty good. I cannot say they are amazing, but not bad. As I already said, Yumdigi X has Full HD video resolution and electronic image stabilization. The footage is really smooth. Also, the video has enough details and natural colors. You can also shoot video in wide-angle mode. In some cases, the videos in wide-angle mode look even better than regular one. However, just like photos, it is better not to use wide-angle mode to shoot video at night. It is very bad.
So, in general, I like the camera of Yamada GX, as the photos on 48 megapixels camera are very good. Also, you can take decent pictures on the wide-angle camera and a depth camera. However, 8 megapixels of wide-angle camera is very awful at night. The photos and videos are bad quality. What do you think about camera of Yamada GX? Write in comments below. Thanks for watching this video. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel, Tech Brothers.